Hey everyone, I just wanted to show you some bars I've picked up over the last couple of weeks. Uh, first up is uh, JM uh, one ounce bar. This one is the old style, I think. I think this is the old style with the plain uh, back. I got these from from uh, Atmex, as you probably guessed. And if we compare those to, hang on a second, the newer upside down version with the JM on the back. Arguably the uh, the older style are a better had a better bar I think but you know they lose obviously over time they lose their uh, they lose their shine a bit but that's to be expected. Still beautiful bars I think in any in any size. So I got um, a few of the older style bars, and I also picked up locally um, one ounce uh, Engelhart bars, which I think out of the three styles, are certainly my favourite. And they're all actually in, in, in pretty good shape. For um, because as you know they don't they don't make these anymore. I suspect these are probably some of the uh, the most recent of the bars they, they, they made. Uh, simply because they're in the in the best shape. But I've got no reason other than to state their interest. Think that that's the case. If anyone knows. If I'm right or why I'm wrong, then, then please let me know. So those are the Engelhart. Those are the new JMs. Sorry, the old older JMs. And this is the new JM. Got a few of these. I think uh, they were part of an earlier video I did actually. But uh, some nice, nice bars. And from there, of course, I still have. Some of the uh, the smallest bars they made up to and including. This is going to be hard to show, but here we go. This is, if you can see it, the one gram JM bar. It's hard to believe silver ever really got to a price where one gram was a sensible bullion. Well, perhaps I never thought about it like that. And that's the one ounce. I think uh, I've shown these before, but just I thought since we're looking at the one ounces, I'd show them again. That's the 10 gram, and there's a 5 gram here, I think. Yeah, there's a 5 gram. Can you see that? They're hard to hold these things. That's got a plane back, actually. I do have. I think I do have the one with the that's the five gram again uh, with the JM on the back. Uh, I, I think this one actually you can probably tell is is uh, a bit toned, but it's not the end of the world. And then from the sublime to the ridiculous, there is a. One kilo Falcambi bar. And we're crazy beautiful. I'm sure many of you will think a brilliant bar. Doesn't really carry this sort of premium, but you have a look at it up close guys, it's hard to resist. Anyway, that's the one kilo of candy. And then, let me just put a pair of gloves on. We'll see why in just a second. We top off with, if I can get these gloves on, hold tight. Here we go. With the one kilo Pam Suisse, which